Colne Valley Stud Maiden Stakes. Six furlong on the turf. Boston Roscoe up the top for Pontypool Racing as is the favourite. Everton Brook Marco. Sanctuary uh, Marmalade. Uh, Torn Coup Flay. Polyphagate. Pure Purgy. Splicing Polecat. Crackerjack Lad. Carasarkle Eric. Macarsib. Uh, then we've got Renato Rocket, the outsider. Come fly with me. Groovy moment. And Xena for Django. Racing, a little flat-footed Sanctuary Marmalade. Uh, out fast was Marco and wider is Carasarkle Eric. Also between them there, Groovy Moments, Splicing Polecat, Boston Roscoe, Makarsib. Uh, down on the fence is Everton Brook. And also there, proliferating out the back there. Come fly with me, Cracker Jack, Lad Zena, and Tornku Flay. So he sprint towards the three furlong pole. And down on the rail, Splicing Polecat now leads from Markasib, uh, who quickly takes over the running from Groovy Moment. They're across the track here at the two furlong. Splicing Pole back, Cat kicks back. It's Markasib in front, but only. And momentarily, it's splicing Polecat Masabib. They're going head and head at the furlong out wider. Karasarkal Eric and racing home well is uh, Tornku Flay and uh, Zena. But at the uh, inside the half, and it's splicing Polecat and Karasarkal Eric across the track. It's actually quite hard to pick them apart there. We've got the fourth horse mentioned here. Oh, that's strange there with um, Martin's horse in fourth. That was a mis Yeah, not sure what the game was doing there, but uh, Splicing Polecat gets up for Darren Thompson, so congratulations. Karasarkal Eric for Steve Rand was second. Third was Groovy Moment, Mark Jones. Fourth is uh, Zena for Django and uh, uh, Karsib for Shadwell was fifth. There was a few running on quite fast late there that were catching my eye, sort of interrupting my call. So there's um, some trainers there with horses to look forward to.